Hello, Carolina Girl Hoop Report followers. We're here at the South Carolina Basketball Coaches Association Media Day for the 22-23 season. I have with us class of 2023 forward, Lindsey Garner from Lexington High School. Lindsey, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. Absolutely, absolutely. This is like, you know what I'm saying, the last couple of years, we've been really rocking and rolling here, Lindsey. Yeah. Um, Talk to me about this this, this summer. Um, you, you came over, played with ABC Lightning. My guy Gary Williams, shout out to Gary, ABC Lightning. Um, talk to me about this. You really kind of like grew up a lot on the AAU circuit this summer and really established yourself as a you know one of the top you know post four prospects coming out of uh, South Carolina. Talk to me about this year and what did you? How did you grow? What did you get from it? To, let me know. Uh, I really had to do a lot of practice and you know the different coaches that I've had. They've helped me develop and. Mm -hmm. uh, just keep getting me in the gym and getting me the exposure that I really needed to, to get to play at college. Is there any um, experience this summer? I know I caught you in Indiana a little bit when you had the Blue Star event. Um, I, I caught you at um, in Atlanta at the Brandon Clay event. Is there any any game? I, you know, the, the buzzer's ringing, but we're not going to class right now. We're playing hooky to do this interview. <laughs> Don't get her in trouble, administrator. Um, is there any game or, or situation that stuck out to you this summer as, hey, I think like I grew up in this moment or put myself on the map a little bit, matching up against these players? Any one of those really stick out? Really all of them, really all of them. Like you go from each one and you're like, okay, well, these teams are even better than my team and we got to figure it out. You know, you got to beat them somewhere else. Absolutely. So listen, um, in Atlanta, you're playing against Exodus, and they're bringing in 6'4 after 6'4 girl, <laughs> and you're out there battling against everyone, sometimes going over the, you know, two girls that are taller than you to get rebounds and putbacks, and it was just like you, you really showed a lot in regards to your resilience and ability to battle against bigger, stronger players. Because you, you, you were going up against two girls that are like nationally ranked on ESPN, yeah. and you were toe-to-toe -to -toe with them all game long. And it was, like, it, was a, it was amazing. And then in Indiana, at the Blue Star event, you were just outstanding. You know what I'm saying? Guarding the perimeter, playing on the interior, really being effective in transition for and ones. You know, I think that those, you know, the, the playing against that Illinois Rockets team with that really, really good athletic young young player, yeah. girl named Trinity Jones, and then obviously going against uh, Exodus with, um, um, goodness gracious, the one girl, Riley Hamburger, I believe the name is, she's going to Virginia Tech, and then yeah. the other girl who's only a, a junior now um, that plays for Long Island Lutheran, the, the, the name is, um, you know, escaping right now, but just an unbelievable battle this summer that showed your resilience, your ability to play against top competition. I, I don't even know what else. I think that, that Atlanta event was when you got offered by uh, North Georgia. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The coaches see you going up against – what is supposed to be bigger, stronger, talented players and battling like you did. I mean, it was just amazing, amazing to watch. So, oh, we skipped over this whole thing. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> North Georgia University. You're going to be attending North, North to West. <laughs> no, my God, no. <laughs> West Georgia University. I'm so sorry. I know there's a North Georgia and they're probably yeah. like, Wait, that girl's coming. <laughs> they're probably watching film right now. I'm sorry. West Georgia University. Yeah. Um, uh, super excited. It sounds like the coaches, when they saw you, they, 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 they wanted to have you right away on campus. Talk to me about that opportunity, the visit, the recruiting experience, and then obviously the commitment to West Georgia. Yeah, so I went to go visit there, and it was just beautiful. And I was talking to the coach, um, Joanna Reese. She's amazing. And, you know, you feel that connection when you get there, and you're like, yeah, this is my place. This is where I need to be. And, like, just meeting the team and, you know, like the different girls and saying what they do and, like their daily lives, you know, it just felt like home. Um, absolutely, absolutely. And you know, in the recruiting process, everyone that when they finally pick their school or know where they want to go, that's what they all say is they, they, they know when it's home, when you go on campus or you've been talking to the coach good enough and you're finishing each other's sentences and it's just, you feel like you know where you need to be and that person that has your best interest at heart from the university side. Um, going into, you know, Lexington, obviously one of the top you know t teams in the state again this year. What are some of the things that you guys are going to need to do? You know, this year, senior year, overcoming that hump. You played in some amazing games last year. Obviously, not just in a regular season where I was at that Queen of Castle event where you're winning buzzer beaters. But what are you going to need to do to overcome this hump and be a Colonial Life for the state championship? We really got to stick to defense. You know, boxing people out. We're we're a little bit smaller this year, and we got to you know we're rebuilding. We have a few younger girls, but mm -hmm. obviously we can still do it. Um, kind of just learning each other's games right now, and I think we can get there. What are some of the things you're working on so that when you get to West Georgia next June, um, June or July, whenever you, you you get to campus next summer, 
that you're going to be ready to compete from starting spot game? Definitely my like outside game, my outside jumper, my three pointer. Um, just keep running the floor. You know, it's a faster pace and a bigger court. Um, and like hitting people when I get in the paint. You know, put it in the basket. Absolutely. I mean, the, you're, you're running a floor, your athleticism, your ability to face up and get to the rim, you know, your, your baseline drives and finishes this year have been way more consistent and, and just sharper in regards to getting there and finishing. So just I, I, I truly see your development to get to this point, but I'm really excited about what you're going to do in the future to get better and prepare for your collegiate career. So um, enjoy watching you play these last couple of years and, you know, SAD's going to be senior year coming up, but, um, you know, Congratulations, man. West Georgia's getting a good one. Um, congratulations to Coach Reese down there. You guys have, you guys really, really, really got, got a diamond in the rough here with Lindsey Garner. So um, get ready for senior year. Yeah. Win that state chip. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Thank you, Lindsey. Thank you. All right.